Okay, we have here today another interesting integral. This one's from MIT 2024, problem 11. We have the integral of cosecant squared x tan 2024 x dx. Okay, I was really liking this one for a few different reasons. First of all, they managed to get the year in the problem, which is always important to me. But the other thing that was so interesting is they got a cosecant here. Now, generally what we want is secant, but secant works well with tangent. And particularly, if we were to do a u substitution for tangent, the derivative of that is secant squared. So at first, I wasn't really sure how we were going to get tangent to work with cosecant. But what we can do is actually write everything in terms of sines and cosines. Sine and cosines work together. Maybe that'll clean things up. So let's just rewrite it. Cosecant is 1 over sine. So I'll write this part as 1 over sine squared x. Tangent is sine over cosine. So I can write this as sine 2024x over cosine 2024x. And then from here, what I'll do, I'm just going to cancel out. We get two sines here. I'll just cancel here and, and convert this into 2022. But then I can do another rewrite. And what I can do with cosine, I can break this up. I can write this as cosine 2022x to get it to work with this. And then we'll have cosine squared x. So when we do the rewrite, let's just set this up. So we're going to have, here we're going to have sine 2022. And here we have cosine 2022. Putting those together, we're going to end up with just tan 2022x. And then here we just have we just have this like one over cosine squared x, but one over cosine squared x I can write as secant squared x. And so what just happened is we fixed this problem here, and now we've got our secant squared x. So now we're set up for our u substitution we want to do in the first place. So we'll do a u sub, and my u sub will be for just tan x. So we'll do that over here. We'll take a derivative. Du is going to be this thing, secant squared x dx. So now I'll just go ahead. This is going to become just u to the 2022. Everything over there is just our du. So we'll just call this du. And now we have a large exponent, but it's just power rule. So we can just basically finish this off or integrate in u. So this is going to become u 2023 over 2023. Back substitute here. And so we just get our final solution of tan 2023 x over 2023. Put a plus C on there, and that's it. Okay, really good problem from MIT 2024. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a good day.